Hello and welcome to this short video explaining how temperature can affect read relay performance. Read relays are often the best switching solution in many varied applications and understanding how temperature can affect them will help to maintain optimal performance. For a read relay, it is the current flowing through the copper wire windings of the coil that generate the magnetic field to operate the read switch. So for a fixed nominal coil voltage, the coil resistance determines the drive current. For example, at 25 degrees Celsius, a standard nominal 5 volt read relay with a 500 ohm coil may have a maximum operating voltage of 3.75 volts, meaning that there needs to be 7.5 milliamps flowing through the coil to operate the read switch. With copper having a positive coefficient of resistance of approximately 0.4% per degree Celsius, this will result in the coil resistance increasing with temperature at this rate. At 85 degrees Celsius, an increase of 60 degrees will result in an increase in the coil resistance of approximately 24%. And to maintain the required current, the operate voltage will increase to 4.65 volts. As the temperature increases beyond 85 degrees Celsius, the read switch may only just be operating, which can affect the operating characteristics and result in unstable contact resistance. And as the temperature continues to increase, the relay will not operate. Other important factors to be considered are voltage drops across the relay drivers, resulting in insufficient coil voltages at elevated temperatures, and for read relays not manufactured by Pickering, magnetic interaction with adjacent relays can increase the operate voltage. In reality, Pickering designed their read relays to have typical operate voltages less than the 3.75 volt maximum for a nominal 5 volt part. For example, here is the distribution plot of operate voltage for a thousand pieces of the Pickering 109P1A52D. With a typical operate voltage of 3 volts, this ensures correct operation and optimum performance all the way to the standard maximum operating temperature of 85 degrees Celsius. In applications where higher working temperatures are required, read relays with increased magnetic drive can be designed to ensure correct operation up to 150 degrees Celsius. Sometimes the performance at lower temperatures can be a consideration in an application. Most relay manufacturers give a minimum operating temperature of minus 20 degrees Celsius, but this is a general figure and there are no changes that will affect the performance of the device. As the temperature decreases, using the 500 ohm coil as an example, the resistance will fall, making the device more sensitive. For the majority of Pickering Reed relays, an operating temperature as low as minus 40 degrees Celsius would not be an issue. Some other manufacturers use very hard transfer molding materials which may transfer stresses to the glass reed switch, but the Pickering Soft Center provides excellent protection against this. At elevated temperatures, changes in the insulation resistance will need to be considered as the majority of insulating materials will see their insulation resistance fall with the increase in temperature. This graph shows the changes in insulation resistance at 1000 volts with temperature for a 104-1A-12-3D. Lower insulation resistance will result in increased leakage current, and although still much better than solid state relays and other switching technologies, with high voltage relays it can be a consideration. Improvements are possible with specialist potting material if required, and discussions with our technical team can help find the best solution. Thanks for watching. To learn more about read relays, please visit pickeringrelay.com.